Hey ladies, I know it's been a while since um, I posted up a video, but this video is going to be, as the title says, a collective haul. Um, it just kills me. Like, I, when I buy a whole bunch of makeup, you know, I tend to leave it in the bag because I'm like, you know what, I'm going to do a video and I'll get to it. And then, you know, days just pass and the bag just sits there and just starts to collect um, over time. And now it's just like, you know what, I need to do one because I need to put this makeup away. So this is going to be a collective haul from eBay, from um, the Dollar Tree, gifts from loved ones, um, and Target, and Walgreens. So little bits and pieces from each store. So the first thing I'm going to show you, I guess, is from Target because I think I only bought um, one thing from there. So... I bought this um, crease brush from the Studio Tool line, and it looks like this, and I've already used it. I think this is my second one. This is the crease brush, and this is about like $2. It's really, really inexpensive, and it has a nice fluffy tip to it, and this is what I use to get the outer corner of the eye. And it blends really well, and you can even use it as um, a highlight brush, too. So this is a really good brush. The Studio Line brushes are really good, and they're very inexpensive. So that's what I bought from Target. Now, from Walgreens, I didn't buy too much from there. I just um, don't know where I put that pencil, but I bought one lip pencil, I believe the color is mahogany, so it's kind of like a a taupey nude color, um, just like a brown brownish color. So I bought that, but I don't know where it is right now. So, and it's from the Jordana brand, and of course, I had to buy three more of the Jordana. Um, this is the eyeliner pencil in dark brown. If you guys could see that. Oops. Some dark brown and Jordana. And um, I don't know. I guess my worst fear is that they're going to run out or they're going to discontinue these things. So I guess every time I go over to Walgreens, which I, I rarely go to Walgreens, honestly, I usually, and then when I do, I buy a whole bunch of pencils. So I bought three of these. I think I actually bought four. So I put one somewhere. And then I went to the Dollar Tree, and, um, oh yeah, here's the fourth one. Ah. Um, so I went to the Dollar Tree multiple times, so it's just more of just, a, as, as I said, a collection. But Joseph also buys me um, stuff from the Dollar Tree when he goes there on his lunch during his breaks. So, um... He always looks at the makeup aisle for me, which is really cute. And, you know, he knows what I guess I pick up and what I have. So he knows I like this LA Colors um, Mineral Eyeshadow that's pressed. And um, this is in black because um, the first one I bought cracked on me. So I tried to fix it using rubbing alcohol and it just didn't turn out really good. So I bought another one. And these things are great. Um very pigmented so that's the black and this is what I have kind of in my outer crease right now I use that equal tool brush from Target and just used it to blend in and and then yeah that's what I have and that's what he got me thanks babe and then I bought um, an LA Colors this is a black brown eyeliner or brow pencils. And it comes with a sharpener and two pencils. And um, I don't know, I just, it was like for a dollar, it comes with a sharpener, two pencils. And it's kind of like the color of the Jordana eye pencil, so I bought them. And they're honestly really, really creamy. They're really, really creamy. Creamy and pigmented. So, really great. Love these pencils. Gotta try them out, but so far I'm liking that it's very creamy and 
and seems like it will glide on really well. Okay, and then I bought um, a bronzer from LA Colors. And this is just Bronze Glow. And it looks like this. And I don't know if the camera could pick that up. But just gives you a little bit of a it's kind of like a bronzy color. Hopefully you guys could see that. I thought it was really pretty. I haven't used it yet, so it look it would probably look nice as an eyeshadow as well too. And then I got this one in toast. This is from LA Colors again. And this is a blush. And let me do a swatch. If you guys can see that. It's a really nice, like, kind of natural pink color. I liked it. And then I bought two of these um, NYC pencils. And I bought one. Um, I'll post that link to the video down below or something or put an annotation to the NYC haul that I did. And these pencils, the retractable ones, are really, really great. Um, they glide on really smooth and they're very pigmented. So I got one in Plum Perfect. I'm not sure if I have this one. I honestly thought this was black, but um, it was purple. But it's fine. I'll probably just go back and get a black one. And this just glides on really nicely and it stays on, has a good staying power, and it's very vibrant. Vibrant. So I love this pencil. And this one is in Brazen Blue, and it's just that nice blue color. But this one for some reason does not glide on really well. I think this might have been a defective one, so I probably won't use it, or if I do use it, I'll probably use it as a a base or something like that, because it'll be too harsh to kind of scrape on my eye, because it's not gliding on the way it should be. But that's the color right there. But as you see, like, just going like that, it doesn't go on. Like, it kind of feels like it just breaks down, and not all of them are like that. This is, like, the only one that I own that does that, so... I think this is just a defective one. So I got that. And then I got an NYC Mod Quad. And this is, oh yeah, well, it's a quad. But I guess the name is Mod Quad. This is the name of it. And it just has um, a cream liner, um, a highlight. It tells you all over the lid and contour color. Let's do some swatches for you guys. So that's the silver, kind of teal color, and blue. And this is the eyeliner, which I don't know, I haven't really used this palette yet. But it might be good to use that cream liner as a base to apply these shadows. But I haven't really used it as an eyeliner yet. So we'll see how that goes. And then I saw that they had um, eyelash adhesive. So this was only a dollar. So I will try this out and let you guys know. Because if it works as good as my lash grip or even lash duo, which I don't own. But I know that works good. But if it works good and um, holds my lashes well, then I'll let you guys know. I'll definitely do a review on this one for you guys. Um, it doesn't say that it dries clear. But it's a white glue and it says it dries quickly. So we'll see. And then I bought this crazy color LA Colors palette in Eye Candy. And it's just a whole bunch of bright colors, and I just wanted to try that out and see how it goes. 
And then I bought this NYC um, lip gloss. And this is a great lip gloss. It's very pigmented, very opaque, a little goes a long way. You don't even have to use any lipstick, I think. And this is, and the thing about these it is these things I, don't have the names on it. It just has a number, and this is 557. So I saved the little plastic thingy. And this is in Black Cherry Frost. So let me show you guys. It just has a doe foot applicator. But it's very, very pigmented and vibrant. That's what it looks like. Out of the tube. Now it's just like one swipe. Um, really, really vibrant. I would, I would definitely rock this. Like, hopefully I'll do a video and show you guys how this looks on. So I'm really excited for that. And then, and then Joseph bought me this eye to eye color and this is in blue smoke and for some reason this one he bought me another one which this one's in chocolate kiss this one is what I have on my eyes right now besides the black and I love this one I use this one on an everyday basis almost and um, but this one for some reason doesn't really give a great color payoff so I don't know what's up with that but this one, the Chocolate Kiss, has great pigmentation. So I don't know if this was just defective or what. But this is also a dollar each. So I'm going to go ahead and cut it off here and go on to part two because I don't, I have a few more things that I've bought and I don't want to rush through things. So yeah, click on part two and I'll have the link right here. Alright, bye.